Track around and so releasing it just to send signals through it. That's yeah. let's go. They want to have the complete commitment to the command as I get up closer. So, here we'll go into this guy, have her sit, let her just soak it in. And I'm just touching on the pressure points of my okay. fingers just to keep her sensory system more organized while she's experiencing. talking about with the distance is it trying to build that space oh between you and her yeah that's got it, it. So not the between the dogs like being closer because in real life she's gonna not be on a leash or on a command she's gonna be to feel that even though we're not right over her there's some degree of security we can provide got it. first so to help get perfect and let her just sit there for a few and soak it in the next thing we do after this starts working is build some distance so she's actually closer to the dog with the command bridging the gap but you're not just you know, the whole time pumping away. Uh, efficient way to just change her angle without shoving her and making it all disaffected. Really good. Much better.